Hi y'all! Welcome, welcome. Thank you for clicking on this video. If you're new, I hope that you'll want to subscribe to the channel and hit that bell so you'll be notified of any of our future videos. We do videos on crystals, on magical things, as well as herbal remedies. Today we're going to be opening the Wolf and Time box for August, which arrived in my mailbox on August 29th. The theme this month is Gaelic Sea. So let's get right into it. Know me, take the time to dig deep underneath this red heat. We could really So this is the Wolf and Time box for August. Mine came on the 29th and the theme is Gaelic Sea. Wolf and Time just restructured and they now have a quarterly bone and steel box that's Celtic related. That's five to seven items for $42. And then they have the Wolf and Time box. They just kind of combined three of their boxes and now they have the Wolf and Time box, which is eight to 10 items for $54. And in the video description, as well as pinned on the comments below, there will be a link with the code KARMA15, because if you click on that link and use that code, you'll get 15% off your order. I hope you're excited to open this box with me and see what we have this month. I know last month got mixed reviews. There were a lot of DIY kits, which I absolutely love, but some people felt that the value for the box maybe wasn't right on. But somewhere on Facebook, I did see the value of this box and I didn't write it down, but it's a great value box. So I'm super excited to see what we have in here. Now, as we open the box, you'll see that it's jam packed. Oh, we got some squigglies on it of everything that's in the box that I'll be taking out one by one to kind of show you. I did receive an email from them that says premium Amazonite, not adventuring. Unfortunately, we have to give you a spoiler about the premium crystal in your upcoming subscription box, but there's another surprise in there. So at least you won't be, that won't be spoiled as well as what form your Amazonite Amazonite is coming in. Your crystal has been mislabeled as adventurine, but it is indeed Amazonite, and all of the elements, properties, and descriptions are correct in the letter, but the name of the crystal itself is not. So just a little typo there. Pull out this stuff. Woo. Oh, jam-packed box. So first I'm going to pull out the letter, and each month there is a description letter that comes, and I will be reading this as I hold the items, but know that my videos are time stamped. So if you don't want to listen to me read the descriptions, you can just boop, go right to the next item in the box. All right. So first I'm going to pull out my card. Ooh, depth. May you immerse and go deeper. If you got that card, what would that card say to you? love the painting and the sea theme is amazing go deeper hmm. chosen just for you from the deck of pippa best connect to your card and its message the soothing image of the sea the personal reflection for your path and the wisdom given to you by your guides your adventures start each day it's always new and you have the power to change it make it magic claim your power and your true authentic self and let the healing power of the siege cleanse your soul. Selkie, and this is a beautiful page done. And this gives the whole legend of the Selkie. I'm going to read the first paragraph. Um, the seal, good folk or fay, origin, the Gaelic sea, Ireland, Scotland, and I can't read that. It's a little bit um, funky there. Can you tell what it said? 
The Selkie or Silky are also known to some in the northern parts of the original merfolk and can transform from seals into humans by shedding their skins. Only they must have their skins to transform back into their seal form. And this is where many of their tales come from because in that necessity, villagers have taken advantage of them many times in capture. So I'm not going to read all the rest because you should get this box. Okay, so she has it written down with both the Selkie watercolor print and Grimoire page. So this is the Grimoire page. And then let's look at the picture because, oh, and I love the way she did it. She did um, was trying to find a better way to do these. And I love that it's almost like in a frame already. Um, the paper is a little bit thicker, which is nice, but I actually really like it in this cardboard and I will utilize it in the cardboard because the cardboard acts like a frame if I can get it back in here to show you so she's got it in this little cardboard frame which is perfect for me because I love putting them on stamps and using them isn't that gorgeous oh my gosh cat those little seals being selkies how inspiring I just love her work and she does have videos of her doing these on their web page on the wolf and time YouTube channel so Feel free to go watch that as well. So let's see what she has to say about these. The Selkie watercolor print and grimoire page created by Cat for Wolf and Time. The Selkie is, water, is a watercolor painting of two beautiful seals swimming through the kelp forest deep in the Gaelic Sea. Although one is looking deep into your eyes as she stops to see who is watching her. It is the Selkie, the magical fae of the sea that will shed her skin when no one can see her. Her story is on your original grimoire page printed on recycled handmade paper, so you can learn all about the lore, associations, and history. The seal itself brings you the powers of introspection, healing breath, and deeper understanding of your purpose in life. You can watch the shaman ritual of its creative process on the YouTube channel Wolf and Time with meditative music while you connect to the intention of the selkie soul. I love, I love, love, love her artwork. And this is one of my favorite ones. I have like three or four that are my very favorite. And look, went so well with the depth, go deeper. Okay. Then we have, um, looks like a little package of papers. And maybe some stickers. I don't know if that's a sticker or not. A little butterfly. A little empty page. It's like we've got a card, peacock. As below, so above. And this pretty picture. Oh, it's got this on the back too. some worlds a couple more things just some little papers and on the very back oh that's pretty kind of got that shimmery silver to it so a little packet all different little cards and stuff let's see what it says about this hmm. maybe this is just extra Oh, it does say Gaelic travel log and vintage Epherma e packet. So maybe this is the vintage Epherma packet. So let me see if I can't find that travel log in here. So packed. Oh, how pretty. It's all kind of dusted off. Look how pretty. I love these. I have a lot of them, but I absolutely love them. The little lock, and then the paper inside, and perfect size. Oops, a little butterfly in there too. It's the perfect size for taking with you like into the forest and just jotting down little notes and that kind of thing. Very nice. So, this and this. 
Gaelic Sea Travelogue and Vintage in in Ephemer E P H E M E R A Ephirma Packet. Your new handcrafted journal is embossed leather and comes in either blue or brown with a book lock, a hook lock, and cotton recycled paper inside. It is for you to record all your stories, poems, Celtic myths, sea observations, sketches, spells, recipes, rituals, thoughts, meditation, oracle readings, dreams, or travel with. It comes with your own unique Inferma packet of vintage paper made just for you so that you can be as creative as you want to start your expressive pages with beauty and craftsmanship, making every word sing like the song of a selkie. As the journals come from a small business in New Hampshire and the packets are put together by Wolf and Time. Still so many things in here. So then we have a Gaelic stew, sea stew recipe with a packet of herbs on it. Ingredients, four large sweet potatoes or golden potatoes, six to seven carrots, some shallots, green onions, oat or almond milk, seasoning mix, which has kelp, Irish moss, and smoky salt blend, and then water, and then you could add shrimp or all kinds of things. That looks yummy. And the Irish moss, then there the moon, feminine, water, money, luck, and protection, the sea kelp, Jupiter, masculine, water, balance, protection, and prosperity. See what they smell like. Oh, that smells good. How nice. I like to cook, so that's kind of fun. Gaelic Sea Stew Recipe Card and Herbal Packet, handcrafted by Wolf and Thyme. This delicious recipe is to bring you all the flavors of the sea while helping you craft with herbs and the magic of all the elements. You can make a vegetarian, vegan, or seafood, and it's printed on recycled handmade paper. It's an original recipe from my cupboard using fresh ingredients with intentional energy and you will be able to see me make it on the creator summary video for this month on their YouTube channel. How fun is that? I love that cat. Thank you. All right. Let's see here. Then we have, I think I saw this. Um, Celtic Sea. Cumber bag. Celtic Sea Cumber bag. The letter couldn't fit me into. <laughs> this soft, eco friendly mesh bag is perfect for combing the sandy shores to gather driftwood shells, hagstones, dried seaweed, and other sea treasures with permission from the spirits of the ancient coastline. It has a drawstring that can be slung over your shoulder and won't let leftover sand settle in the bottom of your sack. However, if you don't have access to the sea, it's also perfect for the market, the riverbank, and the forest. Um, just don't be gathering any selfie skins with it, mind you. <laughs> nice. Always nice to have a bag, and I do like, because I even when I do herbs and stuff, it is kind of nice that the dirt will just come through. So this wasn't in the letter. All right, what do we have next? There's still stuff in here. Should we save the stones for last? Let's see. Ooh. Oh, cool. You guys know how much I love my wax seals. Look, here is a sea knot wax seal. And then it's got a gold wax with it. Oh, I'm so excited. Love my seals. Love, 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 love my seals. And I do not have a sea knot. So that is like perfect. Yay. All right. Do, 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 do. Celtic Sea Knot Seal and Gold Wax Stick. Your new wax seal is a custom piece that was created just for this box and designed after the sailor's knot, which is a Celtic symbol that represents the sea in summertime. 
to be a keepsake of harmony, lasting love, friendship, protection, good fortune, and safe passage. It was considered an amulet that blessed the wearer and as they traveled over the waters. You now can use it in your new sea log, your grimoire, to seal your letters, the tops of jars, or spell bottles, or any other magical use. Simply light the wax stick, let it drip in a puddle large enough, then stamp the wax and let it cool. Yay! Thank you. Yay! Thank you. Thank you. I love when the universe brings me more things that I love, love, love. Okay. Let's do this one. Let's see. I already untied this and figured out that my camera was off. So here we have a bag and there's directions here that say Gaelic Sea Mosaic Tile Instructions. And here's the wooden tile that we're going to make it on. And then inside here, I'm not going to pull them all out, but I'll pull a couple of things. There's a packet of the cement in there. And then there's about four beautiful different mosaic tile pieces. And then some other pieces and a beautiful little charm as well. DIY Gaelic Sea Mosaic Tile Kit. This handmade kit was made so that you could create a Gaelic mosaic tile with your garden, altar, or sacred space. It comes with porcelain tiles similar to broken china from Ireland and Scotland, an eco wood square, shells, a Celtic knot medallion, an oyster gray sanded grout. Directions are included on how to make it, so be creative, add what you want, and make it special to you. Mosaics have been an ancient way to express art and ritual for hundreds of years in Celtic regions and all over the world and can be an intentional piece to your home or practice. I'm excited to make that. Okay. Now I did see a seashell in here, which could go with any of your pieces or any of your practices. And I have a little mermaid uh, bronze statuette by my tub with a bunch of different shells and sea related items and paintings so I'll put it with those as well. Okay now we have a little gray bag and I think this is our next rune stone. Yes it is okay so remember last month we got our first rune stone which was this one and she said that we'll be getting more as we go along. So here's the new one. Oh, pretty. Kind of hard to pick up on the camera. But it's got like an S and then it's got like a dot on it. Really pretty. It's all shimmery white. Talisman Rune Stone, handcrafted by Wolf and Time. One of a kind, this is the second in this exclusive set. The Talisman Rune Stone is a divination tool and symbol that has both meaning and magic in it from sacred and ancient source. It is hand engraved and hand stained from quartz stone and comes in various sizes and shapes to represent the wilds of nature. The symbol represents the rise and curl of the wave that either can crush you if you resist it or safely bring you to shore if you let yourself go with its flow. It also has one dot representing the orb of spirit and universe that is always there protecting and watching over you if you only trust. Each box will now come with another piece just as powerful. When the set is complete, you will get a casting bag, a casting rug, and a complete guidebook. All pieces will be available later on the shop but only after boxes go out each month and the whole set will only be available much later as a limited time offer. So I'm excited to see what these are going to, what other ones we're going to be getting and to have the complete set. All right. Then we have this little bag and it has in it, it says um, Gaelic Sea Protection and Prosperity Ritual.
and inside we have a tea light. Oops. Looks like some different like shells and pieces of things. And there's a cute little gold seashell pendant. Looks like there's a bag of herbs here for offering. And here's our little tea light. And then something wrapped in it. Ooh. So it's an oyster shell. There's the back. And then look at the front. So it's been like hand. It's got like a picture in there that then has been shellacked inside the shell. And look at the edges. It's beautiful. It's got gold all along the edges. Oh, that is so pretty. So let's see. Gaelic Sea Oyster Candle Ritual Kit, handcrafted by Wolf and Time. A handcraft decoupaged oyster shell with liquid gold leaf, pearl, and shell, sea kelp, Irish moss, red sea salt, tea light, shells, scroll, and charm. This kit has everything you need to create a ritual for protection and prosperity using the handmade oyster offering dish, each unique and created just for this box, and your special supplies to connect to the ancient guides of the Gaelic Sea. When you are done, you will have a special new tool for your altar that was lovingly made as if each one was a special dish for a selkie. A piece of art that can give you energy from the ocean full of abundance. That's going to be fun. Okay. I'll do that maybe on my full moon since I missed the new moon. The new moon was just three days ago. Okay. And last but not least, I saved the stones. Now remember that I'm going to have to remember while I'm reading the description that this is Amazonite, not Adventurine. And you got two stones. Each person got um, the Amazonite and then they either got a tiger's eye fire quartz or a rodenite. So first let's look at the Amazon. Ooh, look at that Amazonite. That is gorgeous. Wow. And look, huge palm stone. Oh, that is so pretty. And guess what I got? I got a rodenite, which I love. I have one other piece that I absolutely love. So I'm excited to have another one. I use it a lot. It's really a peaceful stone. So, and they came in a really cute little bag with a ship on it. Water and Fire Premium Amazonite and Bonus Crystal. On the wild Gaelic Sea, the boats look upon the shore during the storms for the fire in the lighthouse to see their way to safety or have a fire upon the sand as the waves crashed while enjoying a fresh fish meal or light a candle and watch the sunset over the ocean's horizon. So for this box, you get two crystals of both water and fire elements. You will either have an, you will either have an Amazonite free form and red tiger's eye or a double palm stone set of Amazonite and fire quartz or Amazonite and rodenite. Uh, Amazonite blue green has all the elements of the wind, water and the earth and activity activates the heart and third eye chakras. Its focus is on vitality, growth, confidence, psychic attunement, self-discipline and inner strength. As you work with its stone, it helps you feel more comfortable in your own skin like a selkie to bring out your innate powers and sensitivities, which may have been blocked by inner disharmonies, gives you strength and optimism, greater prosperity, and the willingness to embrace change and growth while releasing the past. And my Rodenite is a root and heart chakra 
for self-love and protection. Ooh, I'm gonna have fun using these. Those are beautiful stones. I think this was an amazing box. What do you think? I give it two thumbs up. I think it had the perfect mix of a couple of DIY things for you to do. For me, I do it during my rituals for the new moon and the full moon, and as well as enough premium items that you can really see the value of the box. I did want to say the one thing that just is a little bit disappointing to me now that they changed the shipping dates. I do see some videos go up really fast, so they must live close to her. And I don't get mine until after the new moon. And that's the only thing that I would really like is I really like utilizing some of these items for the new my new moon ceremonies and my full moon ceremonies. So the fact that the August box comes after the August full moon, a little bit sad, but these themes are universal, so I can use some of it for my full moon and then keep some of it for the next new moon. So it works out, but it would be so neat if I got it before the full moon so I could use the new box and all the items immediately during my new moon ceremony. But that's my only little bleep, and like I said, not that big of a deal. Thanks so much for joining me. If you haven't already, please hit that subscribe and that bell so that you're reminded of the videos that are coming up. We have a couple of great crystal videos coming up this month, as well as a couple of herbal remedy videos. Thank you all. I appreciate my returning subscribers so, so, so very much. So have a great day. And remember, come back often to the channel where you can say, Karma's my friend. Bye, y'all.